alert. We begin with breaking news about a dozen fire crews battling flames at a towing facility full mm -hmm. of cars. Thanks for joining us first at four. And I, I'm Nicole Versansky. I'm sorry, Nicole, and I'm Brian Duffy. The fire is out, but the search, the investigation into how the fire started is just now beginning. First at four, 19 News reporter Stephen Hernandez working the story. Crews are picking up the pieces after a late morning fire ripped through a towing storage facility full of cars. It's not, not, a, not a common occurrence. Dave Peterson is the assistant chief for the Hamden Fire Department. He says around a dozen different departments were at the scene today. The Hamden Department got the call just before 1130 here at Interstate Towing on U.S. Route 6. When crews arrived, they found a building full of smoke and knew they had to act fast. With multiple vehicles being stored in the building, there's also some fuels uh, and, and uh, other things like that um, that we were concerned may uh, uh, cause further issues, uh, but crews were able to, to attack the fire pretty quick and, and keep it in check. The fire left a clear mark on the business today. Check out this piece of the rolling garage door that was moved out of the way by a forklift, allowing firefighters to easily access inside. The damage also extends to a slew of other vehicles. They're working to remove the vehicles that were burned uh, from the building uh, so we can further overhaul. Thankfully, no one was hurt and no one from interstate towing was inside the building at the time of the fire. Now it's time to find out how this happened. We have the Joggett County Fire Investigation Unit uh, working to determine the cause of the fire. I also reached out to interstate towing, hoping to find out what this fire will mean to their business.